from happening. What if they say, oh yeah, I spiked a low grade fever last time? Tylenol. Yeah. How you medicate your kids? How you medicate your patient? Ask them. You can stop a whole mess of this problem <coughs> in the butt before it ever happens. Yes. Having a major reaction. There's your check. There's your steps. If you start to have a major reaction, here's the rule. You ready? Stop and disconnect the IV. Stop and disconnect the IV. But why, Miss Ellen, why do I have to disconnect? Learn from my mistake. I had a patient having a mild reaction. So I just turned it off and went to a you know, fifth set of vials, assessed my patient, went to go call my, my doctor, right? Went to call the provider. One of my buddies, who's another RN, oh, Jamie's IV is making noise. Here, let's turn it back on. Oh, that is the right look there, kid. That is exactly the right look. You stop and disconnect. Often, you have to take in vitals during a blood transfusion. Sometimes they say Q30 minutes. Once every 30 minutes, sometimes they say Q1 hour. You follow the procedure of your facility. Did we? Yes. How did I say we're going to fix it? Say every meeting. And? Throw the rate. Throw the rate. All right. An acute hemolytic reaction is the kind that likes to kill people. Mm -hmm. You'll kill a bunch of patients. What a damn thing I can do about it. All right. The body attacks the red blood cells. All right. So I'm pouring in red blood cells. My body says, breaks them apart. Hemolytic. Now I got all these pieces of red blood cells floating around in my blood. There's one organ system in my body that's really pissed off right now. Anybody know what that's what it is? My kidneys. My kidneys. That's why they get fat kidneys. Okay? Shortness of breath, chest pain, back pain. Oh my goodness. That is a medical emergency. Mild allergic reaction. Maybe a low grade fever. It's the acute hemolytic reaction that occurs. There's your symptoms of fluid volume overload, shortness of breath, hypoxemia, crackles, and tachypnea. Why? Because they're in left sided heart failure, the fluid's leaking out of the bloodstream and into the lungs. Okay? Tachypnea. My heart gets all kinds of excited. Because I'm short of breath and it wants to move the oxygen into the blood just as fast as I could. Acute hemolytic transfusion reaction. That bottom line that says sense of impending doom. When I was in school, I was, when they would teach us that phrase, I always thought, oh, they're full of it. No, they're not. I've seen it, folks. When a patient looks at you and goes, I'm dying, you listen. You listen. Check, you just check it at the door, put on your roller skates and get gunning. All right. They will complain of back pain, headache, sense of apprehension or increased anxiety, chest pain, and sense of impending doom. It's a real thing, folks. All right, you see it with this, you also see it with PE. Pulmonary embolism. Rapid ready pulse because of the height. Don't give me 650. I want a gram. Well, Miss Howard, what do we do if they have any type of reaction? You stop and disconnect. 